you know, actually, you fit the car pretty well. Um, I, I felt that he was quite cheeky, to be honest. You're going to break it. I'm telling you, I can fit. But, you know, I don't like to judge, no matter how much of a fool he makes himself look. Do you think he's capable of driving your car? If we can get him sitting high enough in the seat, probably have to get him a kid's seat so he can see over the steering wheel. I think I'll make this look pretty good. You look ridiculous in there. Find out why more champions put their trust in the synthetic technology of Mobile One, the official motor oil of NASCAR. Many drivers, one oil, Mobile One. Well, he's getting a nice push from him. Oh, oh trouble! Harvick's around! Oh, we got spun on the back by the 43. How many is it going to break? Go Hold the break. Oh, what a vicious crash! Eric McClure! So the red flag is out in the middle of the first attempt at a green white checker finish, a multi car accident over in turn number three at the end of the back stretch. But the bulk of the concern remains focused around the Eric McClure car. This from NASCAR, they, they report to us that Eric McClure has been talking to the medical staff over at the accident scene. It looked like a net had made a move to try to go up the middle. It looked like he was getting a push and he was going to try to, to make this happen. Hold it closed up. As you can see, as Kyle Busch went over, Brad Keselowski tried to go over. It was Joey Logano that was behind Annette. Yeah, it's like I said, you know, everybody's trying to go to the front, and those holes close up so quickly. You can see the safer barrier deflect tremendously when Eric McClure hit it. Thank God it was there. Yes. McClure is going to be transported to the University of Alabama Birmingham Medical Center for further treatment. And again, any update that we have, we will pass along as soon as possible.